Well, hello and welcome back to my YouTube channel. As you can see, I have a new beauty room and I'm so excited to now have brighter, more access to all my tools and just so many wonderful things to make my videos more awesome. So thank you so much for watching and I'm very excited to start a new journey with my YouTube channel. So as you can see for today's video, I have already started with the basic makeup application that I'm going to be doing. I started with a very light shadow and did a very light contour, very similar to what I would have as my skin complexion. A very dark line on top, zero eyeliner on the bottom, just mascara, false lashes, and just mascara over that, which I used the ELF um, lengthening mascara. The ELF shadow, the ELF shadow is in my eyebrows as well. And the ELF liquid liner is what I use for all that. So basically all of that, the eye area is ELF, which is awesome. I just got a bunch of free products when I ordered my last um, order, so it was really awesome, which I can share in another video. Um, I just absolutely in love with their prices, their products, everything is just wonderful. So if you're on a budget or if you're not, like these products are so amazing and they're, I would say, professional grade, definitely professional grade. You're just not spending your all of your money that you've worked hard for on them. So that makes it even more awesome. The bronzer is by Estee Lauder, but I did use the tinted moisturizer, the high definition powder, and the regular powder by ELF for my face, as well as the Pink Passion Blush, and then blended out it with just a little bit of the other powder I had had, which I believe was the Estee Lauder, but I just use a tiny bit of that. So overall, that's my makeup look for us today. If you want to see it, just ask me and I can probably make a video on how to. But most of my videos that I've already done show you the steps on how to. It's just a new look. Um, today's video is going to be on lips. So you probably could have guessed that since my lips are extremely nude right now. I have nothing on them. But for this video, you're going to need just a few things. You're going to need a bronzer and a highlighter, a lip pencil, um, brush, lipstick, and lip gloss. And I don't believe I'm forgetting anything, so we can get started. You're going to first start with your lip pencil. Um, this is going to be very, very, very important to this application. Because it's just going to shape the overall um, shape of your lip. So you're going, to follow, you're going to start with your corner, and you're going to follow your lip down. And the main part that you're really looking for in this look is the V's right here. The big V. It's going to show a very, very big definition in your upper lip. So you're going to really enhance that. And you're going to go ahead and connect to the corners of your each of your sides here. So as you can see, that looks really crazy, but my lips do look a lot bigger. While we're at it, I will let you know that this is a makeup don't. Um, you don't want to line your lips with a really, really dark lipstick and then do a lighter inner or no inner. It just looks crazy. I mean, just look. I just get distracted by just looking at you talking to you and seeing myself. Um, also, I'm going to accentuate right under here. The darker under here will make your lower lip look even larger. You can even do it a little darker up here as well. So 
So say you have small lips, which is very, very common, or if you feel like your lips are uneven, this is going to be your tool. You're just going to want to trace where you want your lips to be. Of course, you're not going to want to make my lips like all the way up here or down here. You can do it a very, very small section and maybe even just the size of the tip of the pen or the pencil here. And just go a little bit further down. And with that said, nobody's going to be able to notice because you're going to fill in. So it's kind of like coloring a picture, drawing it in. No one knows, you know. So just remember your face is a canvas and you get to wear it all day, which is awesome. So before I keep getting distracted with these lips looking crazy, I'm going to ask if you just grab your lipstick. I'm using Cherry Passion by Estee Lauder. I believe it's now discontinued, unfortunately, but it is an awesome color. Any red will do. And I'm going to start by just filling in basic uh, up here. And you're just going to take where the corner, like the middle of your lip is here, and pull, pull it down with your finger. That will even accentuate the V's in your lips more, as you can see. And then take your lip brush and dip a little bit of um, lipstick on it here. And you can go in and accentuate those even more so. As you can see, I made a little bit of a mistake, but that's okay. So, there you go. I'm going to do a little bit actually more here. Red lipstick is hard to work with, so if you're struggling with it, I understand. <laughs> so, basically, you can see I kind of have a little bit of a mess here. There, that's a lot better. But as you can see, there's still a little bit of redness here. Um, I will make another video on that or if it, this video doesn't run too long then I can add it towards the end. But what you're going to do after that is take your bronzer and dip it in your, I'm using my eyebrow brush here, so that's a really precise dense um, line here as you can see it's just basically a line brush. And you're going to draw underneath your lip here. Just a circle, like well, a half circle, more like a C. And then you're just going to take your regular powder brush with no um, powder on it and just buff it in. So as you can see, it really made my lips look even larger, which is pretty awesome. And then one last trick here is the highlighter powder. You can use a light eyeshadow if you want, if you don't have a highlighter. Um, I'm using this Refract by Mirabella. It's just a really loose powder. And I'm just going to dip my finger in it here and put it in the center of my lip. which will make it look even larger. I did forget my lip gloss because lip gloss shinier makes it look bigger. I would just use a clear lip gloss to be honest with you.
go ahead and add, I'm actually going to add a little bit more of that refract in the middle layer. I think there's something in my closet. So, there you got it. My lips look a lot larger and more voluptuous, great for Valentine's Day, great for any day, anything you want, you got it. But there is a little trick I want to share with you. I can find it here. Just take your concealer. I'm just going to be using this ELF concealer. And as you can see, I got a little bit, like there's a little bit of a pink tone around my mouth. And just take your concealer stick and go over it here and blend it in. Awesome. So now we don't have any pink tones. We have very lush, luscious lips. They look great. And you are ready for a date or if you're going to the grocery store, if you just want to clean your house like this, which is probably what I will do. Um, so yeah, hope you enjoyed and hopefully it helped and have a wonderful day.